Hello, this is Angus Lockwood looking ahead to the second major of the golfing season. It's the US Open and it takes place at Pinehurst number two course in South Carolina. And a special offer for you if you're uh, investing with 666bet.com. If a British player wins, and uh, we have had a few British winners, surprisingly, of the US Open in uh, recent seasons, Rory McIlroy, Graham McDowell and Justin Rose, then you get your money back. Good offer that, and I think that might encourage me to place my investment this week that way, because I think that there is a good chance that McElroy could be right up there amongst the leaders come Sunday night. He's the favourite, and he's had a funny season, but his victory in the BMW, when all that was going on off the uh, golf course uh, with his uh, split from his tennis uh, high-profile uh, partner, Caroline Wozniacki, well, I think that was one of the great sporting achievements of the year so far. When he won three years ago, he was a runaway winner, and he tends to produce his best on golf courses like Pinehurst number two. He's the player to beat, there's no doubt. Bubba Watson has been well supported in the build-up. He's, of course, the US Masters champion, the dual Masters champion. I'm not sure Pinehurst is his course, but nevertheless, he should go well. But a player who I think is the player they've all got to beat is Phil Mickelson. He's the British Open champion, the Open champion himself, who won at Muirfield, probably against the odds last year, having won back-to-back, -back, having uh, secured a famous win up the road at Inverness to win the Scottish Open just a week before. Now, this is the only major championship in the Grand Slams that Mickelson hasn't won. And he's had a lot of close shaves. He was runner-up here the last time the, Open would, the US Open was staged here behind Payne Stewart. He was runner-up agonisingly to Justin Rose. He has had a lot of close finishes in the US Open, five of them, and this is the one that he would like. So I think Mickelson is the player to beat. But it is the US Open, you get unknowns, you get surprises, and the Japanese star Hideki Matsuwama is my best outsider.